Now, Todd, officially Donald Trump faces 34 counts of falsifying business records. In other words, the payment he's accused of making, that's not the crime. It's the way he's accused of making that payment. That's the crime. Former President Donald Trump left no question what he thinks about his criminal trial starting Monday in New York. It's a scam. It's a scam. That's not a trial. That's not a trial. That's a scam. Trump is accused of paying money to an adult film star, Stormy Daniels, so she wouldn't talk about their affair prior to the 2016 election. And by concealing the payment, Trump is accused of fraudulently deceiving the voting public. If they can prove it, uh, they, they seem to have a case. Richard Serafini is a criminal defense attorney in South Florida. He used to be a prosecutor for the Department of Justice. He says what he's most interested in seeing is how much prosecutors rely on witness testimony and how much they rely on a paper trail. Really hard to cross-examination, cross-examine a piece of paper. Um, you know, you can't call a piece of paper a liar. You can't show the piece of paper has previously made a different statement. Trump on Friday announced he would testify at his trial. I tell the truth. I mean, all I can do is tell the truth. Serafini says in the end, Trump's attorneys will decide if they believe Trump's testimony is needed to win the case. But he does believe Trump wants to testify. It really wouldn't be surprising if, uh, to, to hear that someone who's running for president and, and says he is, he is wrongly accused to stand up and say, you know, I want my day in court and I'm going to testify. Jury selection in this trial begins on Monday. The trial itself is expected to last six to eight weeks. Reporting live, Ari Hyde, WPBF 25 News.